having a good day. Today, we are doing the short game Lollapalooza, which means that we are going to try to go through as many short games as possible during this stream time. We're starting... What is the game? It's, it's start with milk? Milk? <laughs> good. I already don't know. Bag of milk. Milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag of milk. We're starting with this. This one was sponsored by, sponsored, is brought to you by uh, trading card games on Steam Community. <laughs> because it was on sale not that long ago for like, I don't know, 50 cents or something really low. And I have, I don't know what has gotten into me recently, but I have gotten so addicted to the marketplace selling stuff on Steam. It's a little out of control. But anyway, so I, I paid zero dollars for this. Lollapalooza, nostalgic for 90s music festival. I don't know what this means. I just got Lollapalooza from from drag. <laughs> so is this a is this a music festival like a Burning Man and uh, the other one? That's what this was from. Okay, I learned something today. We're gonna start, but that means hold on. I have to stop the stream avatars because that's a Steam thing, and I can't have two Steam things going at the same time. Hold on. Also, I should turn to music. Don't lag, please, computer. You can do it, I believe in you. Okay. I'm gonna have to remember to switch the title. Oh, of course, of course it's not here. Of course it's not here! Hold on. This is gonna happen, I think, every game, because it's just gonna be so confused on what's happening. But that's okay. You know, sometimes you have to try new things. I don't want to do screen capture. What are you saying to me? Here, I'll do this. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I didn't- the other reason I didn't have this game up and ready to go is there is no music. Window capture. So, I... Oh, it doesn't see it. Come on, come on! You can do it. Yeah, there we go. Okay. It was an alternative rock festival. Oh, that's fun. I did not know this. Okay. This is a Russian game. That's why Russian is first. But I do not speak Russian. Also, this game! A little brief disclaimer, I guess, about this game as I move windows around. This game deals with uh, mental illness and other issues. I don't know what's in this game. So I can't give a full um, warning list. But I, I know that this is a, the, char the main character hallucinates. So just to keep this in mind if this is something you can handle. I'm also going to split this VOD up. So if you're watching on the VOD, you're just getting this one. Yes. So here we go. I don't know what to expect. I just know that the art of this is very interesting to me. Mm. And they made another, ooh, they made another one. Like a sequel? That's like way longer and more in depth. Let me know if the music is blowing your eardrums out. It's a little loud for me. Okay, help me buy milk. Okay. I can't relate to this feeling. Oh, oh. Okay. Oh, okay. I see. Write down your name. It's a me. My name is Kirsten. I've had many names online. <laughs> this is already kind of spooky, isn't it? This groaning music it feels bad. Is this gonna actually spook me? It's so short. I figured I was safe, but maybe I'm not safe. Already stalling because I'm scared. I like the wig. Okay. Well, good. I'm glad, Dom. I wasn't sure. I'm not sure. It's mainly this area. <laughs> I walked down the road to my store and rehearsed my speech. What is this? This is the store? It's been so long since I've been out of the house that I completely forgot what words to say when entering a store. You don't say anything, right? I'm going to the store! Oh, don't be mean, don't be mean, don't be mean, don't be mean. Who are you talking to? I'm imagining as if I were a character in a game. What it, if it helps me gather my thoughts? I mean, okay. Uh, what game? Well, you know. There are games where you can see the character's thoughts right on the screen, you know? So I thought, if this is someone is reading my mind, I need to be very focused so I don't blurt out too much. Haha. <laughs> I take a deep breath of air. Hello, can I... Crap, I forgot. Well, we're not running the store though, right? So we don't have to say anything, you know? Although, in America, when you enter stores, not like, well, even like Target, no one's talking to you, eh? 
Crap, I forgot. 19th attempt, and I'm failing again. I bite my lip in frustration. So, once again. Hello, can I get... Oh, a bag of milk, right? Wow, that's a whole word more. Thank you, I'm trying my best. Yeah, yeah. I think this time the I sound was longer than usual. Do you think that's it? Who knows? Hello, can I? Oh, I wish I hadn't said anything. No, don't be mean, don't be mean. Don't worry, you can do it. Okay. By the way, you've been walking with your left foot on the pavement and your right foot on the grass for a full minute now. What? My right foot is frozen in the air. How much? 50 steps on the pavement and 51 in the grass. So are we like part of this main character's like inside? You know? You have to undo the previous step. <laughs> How do you imagine that? It's not the first time this has happened. Well, it is for me! It is for me! You've been taught the right way, haven't you? Come on, you're so stupid. Well, I don't like you're so stupid, so... I don't remember. I'm ready to burst into tears. Oh, we can't be... We, I feel so stuck sometimes, you know? Oh, here we go again. So... Step one, take a step back to get your foot exactly in your own footprint. Wait a minute, how do you mean step one? What then? But it's already the 52nd! Or wait, am I going backwards so then it adds to the 50th? It doesn't add up. I think we're focusing on a wrong thing. Okay, okay. Step 50, take a step back to get to your foot exactly into your own footprint. Could you rephrase it just as a little bit? You can't just repeat a phrase without changing at least one word. People don't talk like that. You're hopeless. You make it sound like it's my fault. The store closes in an hour or so. You will be very, very guilty if you don't buy milk. Guilty of what? I feel like, are we living alone? I feel like we need help, you know? Damn, really? It's hard just to go to the store. Well, are you ready? Hell yes! Okay, good. I carefully move my foot backward, looking carefully into the dense grass. I'm so scared. Every time when the, when the screen changes, it's like, what's going to happen to me? I really like this, um, it's very, it's hard to, to tell what anything is, but I think that really matches how um, we're feeling, you know what I mean? Everything's kind of difficult. As I enter the store, I turn to the first person I see. Hello, can I? Huh? Oh, it move, it move, it move. What is this? This one is an eyeball. This one is an eyeball. It's kind of cute. It's like a weird palm tree, right? Oh. Excuse me, what? Oh. Excuse me, what? Are we stuck? Oh. Are we stuck? Are we stuck? Huh? Oh. You shouldn't have done that. What? I just touched you a little bit with my little arrow. He's obviously not going to change his lines. You run the risk of ending up in an endless loop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Excuse me, what? What does this look like for, like, outside people watching this? You know what I mean? Or did, like... Excuse me, what's a big... Small... What? Oh. What is he trying to tell you? He's trying to tell you all. Oh. He's trying to scare me! But how does he know that I'm terrified by the letter O? Oh. oh. This game is quirky. What's so scary about it? I have a frightening image when I picture it in my head. I can show you. Explaining won't be enough, but keep in mind that it'll cost me a does! Okay. This is like an eye. Something like that. So, I'll just continue to ignore his question. What? You're not ignoring it, though. Ah. Uh... We're never getting this milk, are we? We're never getting this milk, are we? I gather all my will into a fist. Oh? Ah. Oh. Oh, it's gone. We got an achievement for that! Oh! My interlocker shook, oh, shook and crawled away. Okay. 
You just repeated after him. And it worked! Do it more often! Wait, I said he crawled away. Did he really crawl away? I mean, I didn't even look at his direction. He just kind of phased out. When exactly did you say that? Just now! Personally, I didn't hear it. I, heard, I read it! You're just trying to distract me. But I know that my words were shown on the screen. The aesthetic of this game I like very much. I do. I really like this. I'm standing by the shelves. On the rack there are bags of milk. Bags of milk? Is this like a common thing? I have never- No, that's not true. I think I've seen a bag of milk one time in my life and I remember it was like really weird. But I can't say that's like a normal thing that I see all the time. It's very rare. I think I was traveling somewhere. But I don't know where. Why would you want a bag of milk? Why would you want a bag of any liquid? It's going to break as soon as you try to open it. You're going to spill it everywhere. Cartons, man. Come on. Canada has milk in bags. Why? What are you going to do with that? You stab it and then it just pours out? You cut it on the top and you have to put it in something else, right? I don't even like milk, okay? I don't know. This is not my problem. <laughs> we both stand. And the milk lies, or maybe... Hey, hey, slow down. Do you even remember why you're here? You need the milk. To buy milk? So buy it. Right here? What do you expect me to say? Um, I guess something like, not here. Not here. Take the bag and go to the cash register. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess the first sentence. And you, as if out of spite, didn't pause before my second one. Do you want to rob me of my little victories? I sigh and reach out to take the milk, or rather the bag with the milk inside. Or rather a bag of milk inside a bag! Oh, we're gonna get stuck. I feel like... Mm, this would be really hard. It would be really frustrating. Or maybe you don't even notice, so it doesn't feel frustrating, that like, certain things you can get caught in. And then it's like, wait, what was I doing? Or a certain amount of time has passed or something. It could be difficult. You drink milk every day? What kind of milk? 2%? Whole? They cut the corner and they put it in a pitcher. Well, why can't it just come in a pitcher? Or a carton? Mm, cartons are good. Big fan of cartons. Or rather, a bag of milk inside a bag of milk inside a bag. We're gonna get stuck. We're gonna get stuck. It's gonna keep going. Oh, come on, come on! 15 minutes before the store closes, hurry up! I remember what these games are called. Visual novels! It's interesting because I feel like this main character is like here and there at the same time and by the way the numbers are written there in full with letters and are visual novels worse than books but they're but they're the authors are not lazy so don't get lazy either yeah i feel like people who are really into books would say the visual novels are worse but i like visual novels because they remind me of those like pick your own adventure books where you like go to different pages Mm -mm -mm. And I grew up with those. I love those, so... Wait, I thought your thoughts were visible on the screen. Not anymore, so watch your mouth! Hee <laughs> hee. Ahem. Anyway, you heard... Oh. Anyway, you heard me! Hurry up or you'll get it... You'll get it at home again? I'm on my way. We're in a bad home situation. Oh my god, what is this? Everything's so distorted, but I kind of like it! Ah, hello, can I get some milk, please? Oh, you look like an E.T. Phone home. Right? You have it. Ah, give. I put a weighty bag on the register. Of course, not just the bag, but the milk too. Hi, can, can, I, can I have it, please? No! Please? No! Please, Mom will throw me out of the window if I get back without milk. Oh, we're young! Oh, this is sad! Our mom! We live with our mom! But why not? And we live with our mom who is causing maybe issues. Nah. 2%. Only a glass before bed? To help you sleep? That sounds hardcore for the stomach. I could not lay down after milk. But I, I don't know. Milk is hard. That's harsh punishment. Yeah, yeah. Give more! But I don't have anything else? Hey. What? 
Okay, we can't- I don't think so. I think the first two are not good. I want to try to have this go as positively as possible. I don't think it's gonna go well, though. This just seems like a no-win situation. Pay for the milk. Haha, uh -huh, really? What would I do without you? I take out a crumpled bill of my pocket and hand it to the cashier. He starts to carefully examine it. It took about two days before he nodded contently and put it in the cash register. Thank you, goodbye! Wait, so we did it! Wait, don't, don't get too excited, itself. We have to walk all the way home. <laughs> and that was, it, we got stuck a little bit coming here. I walk down a familiar street past the gas station. That is a gas station, yes. Outside is scary, though. Inside the store, even though they were like aliens, the music was more happy. This is bad music. This is danger music. What? Milk makes you want to lay down. No way! Milk makes me want to take a Tums and like, sit up for a while. <laughs> Maybe cry a little bit. Heartburn, heartburn. Mm -mm -mm. Milk is not comforting because my body kind of doesn't like it. But even if I get like the lactate or something, I don't know. Milk is like a, it's like a food, you know, like it's like a, a, a filling meal. So I feel like I can't lay down. A bag of milk unpleasantly tugs at my hand, reminding me of the days when I was in physical therapy. Oh. By the way, they gave me a bag at the checkout, so now I'm carrying a bag of milk in another bag. Don't think anything of it. I just love the pyra 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 pyramidal structure of verbal constructions. The gas station is getting closer. How are you feeling? Physical therapy. So... Do you think that there was like some kind of accident that have had uh, some kind of effect on the brain and this is now what's going on? Or was this person always like this and then just so happened that the physical therapy maybe was like the mom threw them out of the window or something else? Hmm. Thank you for your interest. I feel like a mile long bar of ice cream. Ooh, I like that. What is that supposed to mean? Obviously something good. As if I tell you, I think I understand that one. That one I understand. <laughs> that one I understand. Uh, but I'm really interested. Well, look, the ratio of water to milk in the volume of air occupied by me is about 30 to 1. And yeah, ice cream is not the best, unless you want to drink more than to eat. Anyway, the road from the store to the gas station is a stick, and the road from the gas station to home is ice cream. Oh, I see. During today's walk, my body has been to every part of this path. Simple math! I see. I feel movement under my feet. Asphalt grains, petrol stains. I'm trying to keep my balance. And how do people move over something as uneven as a city plane? Gently heel toe, I count my in my mind every meter of the path I walk. I even close my eyes for more concentration. Hey, watch out! Ah. I unconsciously take a sharp step to the side. At the same moment, a huge b A BEAR! Oh my god, where do we live? A huge bear rushes past me with a wild screech. Man, this really is Canada. Hey, I'm walking here. I cast a reproachful glance at the swiftly departing giant. Its red eyes in turn look at me with mockery. Did you see that? How brazen. It was a truck. Oh, really? Although, if you think about it, are there bears with eyes on the back of their heads? Oh, I thought it turned around. You could have died. Come on, are you saying someone would seriously want to kill an innocent girl carrying a bag of milk? Mmm, mm, this is no win. You're sick. Obviously, we're having like hallucinations because we're not seeing otherwise. No, we're having hallucinations. I think that's pretty. I think we can all agree. I think that's pretty obvious what's happening because i think whether this voice that is us or whatever is telling the truth or not i think there's hallucination going on you know but to say the world is a cruel and dangerous place this may feel like then everything has to be more this could cause more problems you know i don't like the idea of saying you're sick though that's so like judgy you know what i mean <laughs> what do I do? I, maybe we'll do this. You're sick. I don't like this, but I feel like if we do this, we're gonna see some horrible, horrible things. You know? Haha. <laughs> hey, 
You just had to say it, didn't you? I'm sorry, I know, that wasn't very nice. This game's in style of an 80s graphic adventure game. Yeah! I like it. It's aesthetics. God, what's gonna happen? I feel bad. We were mean. My journey continues. The This kind of game, in the olden days, you had to type, type, type. What will you do? And then you have to type, type, type. Go to next room. And then it'll be like, what? I didn't understand. And you have to free phrase. <laughs> That's what I know about those games. Mm. You have to be very precise in the words you, you pick. If you think about it, the road from the store has one interesting property. It adjusts to me in the most bizarre ways. When I am in a hurry, all the traffic lights turn off helpfully. When I feel like crying, a cloud appears over me and pours rain streams that hide my tears. Right now, I can feel a cloud slowly gathering over the top of my head. It's because we said you're sick. That's why, God. I'm sad. I'm sorry. I'm really sure this is really... Are you sure this is really happening? What else could it be? Is this gonna be mean too? I don't know. Has it ever occurred to you that it's all just in your head? That's not what the manual said at all. Apparently these pills don't work for me either. I don't know if the pills have nothing to do with it though. Because sometimes like if you are on like a not so good medication that there could be like side effects or something, you know? So... Mm, and it seems like uh, she has some kind of awareness, right? These pills aren't working either. The, the, Text adventure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Text adventure. <sighs> but I don't like the idea of not saying anything. That makes me feel really uncomfortable. Please, I just want to get home and go to bed. I really, really am very grateful to you, but please, no more. Okay, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Maybe we shouldn't say any more. We shouldn't say any more. Just let her go home. Because, I don't know, if you push too much... You don't want to have a problem. We're outside. We don't want to have like a complete mental breakdown outside trying to cross the street. It seems very dangerous. So let's just not say anything. You know what? What? Since I'm a character in a visual novel, I want to talk to whoever is reading this right now. Hi, what's up? Um, it could hurt your recovery. Oh, jeez. But in some ways, Nan, in some ways, this is what's really happening, <laughs> right? So, uh, is it bad for us to entertain? I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it. If you say so, I forcefully squeeze my head with my hands and place a thought block. Out of the corner of my eye, I notice a small bench, the perfect place for a cliched visual novel monologue. I move closer, place a noticeably weighted bag of milk down next to it, and raise my head to the sky. Hmm. This looks like a cell. Listen! I'm a little embarrassed, haha. I realize that I'm going crazy. The medications are becoming less and less effective, so... This is scary. You know this, right? Hmm. Ultimately, things will happen painlessly, I hope. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, I have to type something in? Oh, I do. Um... I think so, right? That you have hallucinations? What do I put here? Oh! We were just talking about text adventure and now I have to type something. Um, maybe I'll say yes. Yes. Please capitalize it! You're ruining the narrative! Oh, I'm sorry. Do you know what I'm talking about? Yes. Really? Maybe. I think I know in a very general sense what you're talking about. I must be nothing like the model protagonists at all, huh? To be honest, I haven't read many visual novels. Sometimes I regret it because now it costs me a lot of effort just to distinguish between letters and words. By the way, if you don't mind, I'd rather not have- I'd rather not name my diagnoses. Let at least you be the one who sees me for who I am. Even though I made you up- don't take that away from me, okay? That's sad. That's really sad. Don't ask me for too much. How stupid does this all seem? From the very beginning, you've been following me, reading my delusional thoughts, hearing my silly conversations. I must seem crazy and weird to you. Haha. -ha. What is it like to see the world through my eyes? Ever since, ahem, something happened, all I see is red. Red blood everywhere. Oh, wow. So you have, like, a red filter? That 
That sucks. That sucks. No, don't worry about me. I got used to it a long time ago. Admittedly, I even forgotten what other colors look like. Can this really happen to you? It's like going colorblind, but instead of going colorblind, you go color red and all you see is red? That's tough. Come on, haha. Hmm. Those monsters from the store, they didn't scare me at all. After all, I know they won't hurt me. Sometimes I think that they themselves are afraid of me. Can you imagine that? By the way, if you want to ask me what happened, please don't. I wasn't going to. Promise? Uh, yes, I promise. Wait, no. I promise. Period. I'm serious. I, that's why I said I promise! Of course, you couldn't help but ask. Well, I didn't ask! Huh? In the end, I'm just talking to myself. Sooner or later, I would have brought it up. So, you're really that interested in what happened to me? I mean, I am, but if you don't want to talk about it, you don't have to talk about it, you know what I'm saying? I won't waste time. What do you see? Uh, you? I see a face. Huh? What was that? Why did I get dot dot dot? Eh? Anyway, this is my dad. Oh, it's your dad! Oh, I'm sorry. I don't know. Look, it's so pixelated. It's hard to tell. I just can tell. It's pixelated gore. Some of his parts, at least. We do have a very difficult family. But despite all the problems, I never would have thought. Sorry, I shouldn't have raised my voice. Anyway, he jumped out of the window and died. Oh, maybe that's why she said something about the mom throwing... Oh, I'm going to be thrown out the window? This is my last memory. Then a long gap. Ah. Strange, very strange. Today is the first time I've ever been able to buy something in a store without a major incident. Well, you should be very proud of yourself. Of course, the medicine helped me. However, I think it's more your merit. I kept thinking, we mustn't screw this up in front of the reader. Or, oh my god, what will he think? Haha. <laughs> she! But that's okay. I don't know why I decided to become a visual novel character for the sake of going to the store today, but it clearly paid off. Thank you. By the way, it seems to me that there are some boundaries in our communication. Yes. That's how I like it. <laughs> okay, that's cute. I like that. And yet, I've been so sad lately. I've been thinking more and more about what my life has become ever since my dad. Well, you know, day after day, it's the same thing. I've tried so many medications that I hardly feel any difference between them anymore. As long as they help me keep me on my feet, I'm happy, haha. -ha. But you know what? Today is a special day because I have you. There's so much I want to tell you, you can't even- was very rude of you. Oh no. No, it wasn't. You didn't do anything wrong. I'm not going to pressure you. I'm just advising you to go home. Oh, yeah. Maybe it's good not to stay out late. Nah. I understand. Well, dear reader, shall we go? I don't like that, though. That makes me nervous. Oh, a puddle. Oh god, what is this? It's like a hole. A tunnel? What is this? When I get to my floor, I hang over the railing. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Repeating this action every day, like a ritual, I stopped being afraid of heights altogether. A few minutes ago, the effects of the medicine finally wore off, so I just enjoyed the blissful silence. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. When I am under the influence of drugs, terrible and unpleasant melodies sound in my head. Mixing with the sounds of the world around me, they create a terrible dissonance in my head. I turn around and go to my apartment. Oh. Mama is there? Oh! Hello, ma'am. Did you bring the milk? Can you back up, please? <laughs> I have- a, I don't like this. This face is scary. This face is like a- those uh, Japanese doll. Hi, mom. Your mom is a doll. Did you bring- yeah, maybe it's good we went home early. We don't want to make this one mad, ne? Yes, mom. 
Are we on a loop again? Oh, did your new medicine help? Um, maybe. Yes, Mom. Go to bed. Yes, Mom. Can you back up Mama? Milk bot! We did it, you guys. We did it. I was so scared. I was gonna say, this kind of game, Nick, this kind of game, I felt like there was no winning. You know what I mean? Like something would happen. Either like something at the store would happen. Or on the way back, you're like getting stuck, you're getting stuck, and then somebody like uh, kidnap you. Or I don't know, whatever. You know, something bad. We made it all the way home with the milk. We did what we were supposed to do. It's a doll. It's a doll. But I don't know. Is it a real doll? Like, is this a hallucination that the mom is really there? But, because the people at the store, obviously people at the store, ne, are real people. Like, I think we actually, like, checked out, got the milk, went home, and we were, like, checked out by somebody at the register. And I think even, like, the, the conversation about, like, a... Uh, some people are like they're more scared of me or that the monster or alien are like more scared of me i think that's true because i think a lot of people that you know seem kind of off for one reason or the other when they are in a store or something like that like people can be very unkind because they're like oh what's wrong with this person or i don't know some people are just very not uh, not so good but i think they can you know what i mean i think that that's that, that uncomfortability because we don't know what she's saying in the store, how much she's saying out loud, what she's doing. Like, the whole thing with the oil monster is like, what did that look like in real life? You know what I mean? That you don't know what's going on, right? Um, but is she coming home to an apartment that is empty because the mom is no longer there? And she thinks that the doll is her mom? Or like, standing in for the mom? Or is the mom actually there and we just see her as a doll? That I don't know. This is so... I don't know. L listen, 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 listen. This is my aesthetic. <laughs> I love this kind of thing. I like this very much. This to me also was, wait, there's, there's another achievement. Um, this game, this game, the way it was, it sold me to buy the other game, the, the sequel. It says one hidden achievement. We're not going to do it though, because this is Lollapalooza. Close it. We only do one game at a time. Not, of course we do only one game at a time. We only do one one go through for every game because we're trying to get through games. 